Hello. In this video, we'll be looking at how to construct two triangles that have one side in common, so they share a side, and they have an additional pair of congruent sides. The reason I want to show you this construction is because eventually I would like you to be able to figure out Hinge's theorem. If you don't know what I'm talking about, that's okay. Um, you don't need to for this video. All you need to know is how to construct these two triangles. All right, so let's go ahead and first make sure that we're labeling our triangles because we're going to need those labels. So let's label all new objects. Once we turn that on, we can use our polygon tool to create a triangle. So we click one, two, three times, and then we close our triangle, and we have a wonderfully labeled triangle here. Okay, so now at this point, we need, well, we need a triangle. We already have that side that I would like to use as our side in common. And we want another congruent side. So let's make a side congruent to our side C. In order to do this, I am going to have to click on my tool here. Let's do this again so we can see it. And I want a segment with a specific length. So I'm going to click on segment with given length. And now I'm going to click here. And remember, we want another side, the length of C. So I'm going to click here. And I want my side to be length C. So I type C and I say OK. And that looks like it could definitely be the same length as C. I'm going to take this and I'm going to use my move tool. And I'm going to move it to a reasonable location. So let's say down here. Doesn't matter. Um, as long as I can now close my triangle with a regular segment. So I'm going to click segment. And I'm going to connect that to that. And now I have two triangles with a side in common and two additional congruent sides, a pair of congruent sides. And so just to make sure, we're going to want to measure these to make sure we didn't make a mistake. And that's 3.09, that's 3.09, and we are all set. We have created what we set off to create. All right, we're done.